Hi, I am Arun. I am working as MATLAB programmer in Spyro Solutions Private Limited. Now I am going to explain the project Compressed Domain Shift Detection on Spaceborne Optical Image Using Deep Neural Network and Extreme Learning Machine. The abstract of our project is Shift Detection on Spaceborne Images has attracted great interest in applications of mar maritime security and traffic control. The op optical images stand out from the remote sensing images in object detection due to their high resolution and more visualized contents. It has two problems. Uh, the first one is compared with infrared and synthetic aperture radar images, their results are affected by weather conditions like clouds and ocean waves. The higher resolutions uh, result in larger um, data volume which makes processing more efficient and difficult. The most of previous work mainly focuses on solving the first problem by improving segmentation or classification with complicated algorithms. These methods uh, face difficulty in efficiently balancing performance and complexity. In this paper, we propose a shift detection approach to solving the aforementioned two issues using wavelet coefficient extracted from JPEG 2000 compressed domain combined with uh, deep neural network and ELM. This is the block diagram of our project. In our, uh, uh, we are taking the input image as compressed JPEG 2000 image. Um, we are taking the image uh, through unmanned aerial vehicle and then the image is uh, compressed through uh, discrete wavelet transform DWT and then uh, the format is uh, JPEG 2000. Uh, it is taken as the input image and then we are doing uh, some modifications in that uh, input image uh, that is uh, input enhancement and then we are doing a sea and land segmentations and then uh, we are getting the wavelet coefficients of uh, the uh, segmented image and then uh, we are dividing it into two low frequency and high frequency based on uh, DNM and uh, it is set as uh, SDA1 and SDA2 and um, we are taking uh, high frequency and then uh, low frequency uh, to the ELM future fusion uh, that selects the which is the suitable image which is uh, uh, which is for the uh, selected image existing and proposed systems in the existing system uh, they used st soi approach based on shape and texture features of the considered image uh, it causes some false alarms uh, but our proposed concept uh, recently uh, works in deep architecture has multiple levels of future representation and the higher levels represent more abstract information here a dln trains multiple hidden layers and uh, unsupervised installations the existing technique is uh, local multiple patterns and uh, local binary patterns but uh, uh, our proposed algorithm is coarse ship locating ship future representation and classification the drawbacks of the existing system is uh, there are two drawbacks first one is uh, missing a detection exists when part of ship is covered by a large cloud when a ship joins a large island uh, or when a gray, a gray of ship is very close to that of its neighbor the second one is false candidates which mainly com comprise clouds and sea clutter also exist the advantages of our proposed concept the multi-resolution analysis and singularity detection the faster detection uh, happens and the compressor, compressed domain achieves much faster detection than a pixel domain. It is more reliable, a better utilization of information. The operation is uh, better, uh, better for extracting. The main advantage is that uh, the method needs no tuning and can even cope with sensors that are different to analyze for a human operator. The application is uh, used in uh, fishery management, vessel, uh, vessel traffic services and naval uh, warfare and etc. For this project uh, we are needing the MATLAB 7.04 version of 2012 A. In our future uh, the proposed work for ship detection uh, may focus on multiple sensors. Thank you.